Hello friends, welcome back to our session. So in the previous session, we have discussed about the introduction to HTML. So in that we have seen uh, the HTML is used to create a web pages and we know that a website is a collection of web pages. So to create a web page, we require this HTML and HTML is implemented by means of tags. So HTML consists of a number of tags, right? So in today's session, let us have a look on the basic tags to be used to create a web page. That means in every web page creation, we will use these basic tags. Basic tags. So as we said in the previous session, every tag will be having the start tag and end tag. So start tag and end tag. So here also our basic tags includes the start tag and end tag. So first, the very first thing is how to write a comment in HTML. Writing the comment. So we know in C language, whatever the text written in between these symbols will be considered as a comment. So the compiler doesn't execute the content in between these two symbols. Similarly, here also there are there is a comment tag, right? So where the browser will not execute that particular statement. So in this comment, I mean in this HTML. The comment is represented as exclamatory mark hyphen hyphen write the comment hyphen hyphen and close the tag. Right. So this is the comment I mean this is the structure to write the comment in HTML. So whatever the comment we are going to write, we should return in between these two symbols. So less than exclamatory mark, hyphens, write the comment and hyphens, close the tag. That means greater than symbol. Right. Next, let us see the basic tags. The first, very first thing is every HTML page will start with the HTML tag. The first one is HTML tag. So the starting tag is HTML. The end tag is slash HTML. Right? So this is the start tag. This is the end tag. So every web page will be starting with HTML tag. So whatever the content we are going to write, that must be in between these two. See. So with the help of text editor, we will write the tags. So HTML, write down the content. After writing the content, close the HTML tag. So whatever the text we are going to write, that must be written in between these two texts. Right? Next. The second one. Head tag. Here we can write H E A D the starting tag, the ending tag, backslash H E A D, and we will write the scripting, the client side scripting both, the client side scripting and the server side scripting. Everything will be written in between these 
head tag right so what is the use of scripting this is can be done for dynamic web pages to create dynamic web pages so time to time the data will be changed right so dynamic web pages so we will see elaborately about these dynamic web pages and the static web pages in the next sessions right so just uh, note down that head in what is the purpose of head in between this head tag we will write the scripting so scripting means client server so both there are two types of scriptings client side scripting and server side scripting so both the scriptings will be written in between the head head tag so the main purpose of writing the scripting is to create the dynamic web pages Next, title tag for this title and tag is slash title, right? So where where we use this title tag? So this title tag is also a sub tag of head. That must be, I mean. Uh, this title tag should be written in between the head. So this must be written in head tag. Right. So what is the purpose of writing this title? So whatever the content we have, we are writing in between this title, that will be printed as a title. That will be displayed as a title. See, let it be. So if you open the web browser, so we can see this one, right? So web browser. So whatever the text we are writing here, that will be treated as a title. So here the title is this one. This is called the title bar. Title bar. So whatever the content we are writing here, that will be printed here. So if you write, hello that will be printed in this place hello if you write here welcome here the welcome will be displayed in the title bar so this is the web browser opening the uh, when you open this web browser the tie in the title bar the title will be placed and this title should be written in between the head tag next body tag see body tag is the actual content to be displayed that means whatever the text we are writing in between this body tag that will be displayed on the web browser see. so we know that so if it is a web browser so this is the title bar and this is the body so whatever the text we are writing in between this body that will be displayed in this portion right so all these three tags should be written in between the html tag because this implies the document contains the html right so these are the four basic tags we are supposed to write in every web page creation right so first of all HTML tag head title and the body see let us see an example so take one text editor oh sorry so take the text editor and write on the code source code so I am writing the source code HTML in the HTML I am writing head in that head I am writing title welcome to HTML I am closing the title right starting tag and end tag 
I am closing the head. Now I am starting the body. Hello friends. Welcome. Close the body and close the HTML. So this is a, a simple example, right? So this is a simple example, the first program, right? So HTML, in between the HTML we are writing everything. So in between the head we are writing the title. So in between the body we are writing the text to be displayed on the web web browser web page see what is the output of this one let us see here let it be this is a web page so here we are writing the title welcome to html that will be displayed here welcome to html right next here we are writing this in the body so it will be displayed here hello friends welcome this will be displayed here so hope you understood this one right so these are the basic tags to be remembered while writing the web page so head in the head we will write the scripting and scripting is used to create the dynamic web pages so let us stop here so in the next session we will see some more tags to be written in between this body right so hope you understood this session so Feel free to post your doubts in the comment section so that uh, definitely I will try to clarify all your doubts. So if you really understood my sessions, like my videos, share my sessions with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thanks for listening. Thank you very much.